guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting really to episode 15 of Fake Grand Order Babylonia. Yes, finally. Even though I'm still packing, sh unpacking shit and stuff like that, I can finally go ahead and watch this and see why in the world everybody was freaking out on Saturday. I mean, between bringing stuff from one place to the other, I had a chance to kind of go on Twitter, but um, I didn't get spoiled, thank God. But I did see people like, saying things but not going too detailed and stuff and I was like okay I'm not one I was like what the hell is everybody freaking out about this damn episode like what the hell happened so I finally get to see but other than that let's go ahead and get started with episode 15 in three two one go <clears throat> do not kill Anna do not kill my child because if you kill the child we gonna have problems that is my child I will literally fight for that little girl and any other little girl from any series that I've seen. Hey, look at little Brady, look at my baby. Oh. Your sisters? Hmm? Oh. What? 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 You can't start an episode like that. Who starts an episode like that? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm not ready for this. It's been, what, like four days since this episode aired. I actually would have watched this last night, but it was like 2, 3 o'clock in the morning, and I was hella tired. <laughs> because if I did watch it last night, I probably would have been able to get it out by today. Oh my god, that sound no, please. Oh, I need my journalistic eyes. Now see, let me just say this. Why couldn't this shit happen when my other best girl was still alive before she was evil and shit like that and everything? This would have been fine. She would have survived. We would have been okay, but no. Jesus Christ. Honestly, I mean, no offense, I did feel a little too easy, though.
Are you fucking serious? Thank you everyone for not spoiling this shit for me. Here comes his motherfucker. I'm hungry. <laughs> How can I go from crying to be hungry? I don't like the way that looks. Mm -mm. The fuck? Merlin? Well, y'all fucking screwed.
what about you? Oh, I thought we would have heard a, a wail or a scream or something, but nah, okay. Yeah, like now, always. Well, mm -hmm. you just don't get killed anyway. Damn. All I gotta say is damn. Fuck. They look like the goddamn shit. Yeah, you did. You jumped. I jumped too. Peace. Ah, oh, hell no. Nah. Fuck that. You can go. Fuck. Oh my god. The only thing that I could kind of compare these things from, they didn't really do a good job of this in the movie, but in the books, it's a better description. You know the weird dog-looking thingies from the Hunger Games, the first book? Yeah! That was supposed to be them, like, a uh, creepiness. Yeah! Okay, get the fuck out. Mm -hmm. Shit, I ain't walking out. I'd be running. Mm -hmm. I don't even mind them when I'm gonna rest. I gotta keep going.
Mm-hmm. Yeah, I feel that too. Of course, you left. Mm-hmm. Possibly because I didn't see him at the time, but yeah, I get that. <laughs> nope. No, not the kid. Hmm. Just, just grab the kid and anybody else as much as you can and get the fuck out of there. Jesus, Loka. It's doing something. Oh my god, no. No, are you serious? Are you serious? You don't have to do this! Don't do this!
happened. That did not just happen. Yo, what? Are you fucking serious? Hold the fuck up. Mm-mm. 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 <laughs> I'm so happy I didn't get spoiled on this episode because, bitch, I would have been heated if I got fucking spoiled. Thank God nothing. Ooh, I'm so happy. <laughs> What the fuck? Are you serious? Oh my god, I can't. I miss Anna. I miss Anna so much. I only have Gilgamesh left and I don't need him to die on me. This man better not fucking die by the end of this dance. If Gilgamesh dies... I'm cussing y'all out. I don't care. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> so now what the fuck is gonna happen? I mean, Jesus Christ. I didn't expect King to get stabbed by those things. But shit. <laughs> oh my god. So, I mean, I don't think he's automatically dead. I, he could probably heal himself some shit like that. I, I, I don't know. I'm kind of scared right now. Like, Help, <laughs> please, because, like, bro, what the fuck? I, I just, I don't know how to feel right now. Like, this episode, honestly, it's been four days since the show has come out. I'm really, the episode has come out, and I'm so fucking grateful that I ain't get spoiled on shit. And I was thinking, I was thinking, like, once I downloaded this episode, like, early this morning before I went to bed, I was like, damn, like, whatever the fuck happened it must have been really good. And I was expecting it. I wasn't expecting Anna to make her sacrifice the shit with Merlin and then that. I was expecting it to be like, I thought Anna was, go- it was going to do maybe a little more backstory on Anna. And then maybe we would have possibly had a sacrifice from her, but then a way to get Anna back and just Anna and no one else. But like, <laughs> I miss my child. Like out of all the characters, Anna, you take it away, my bad. Freaking Sarami from me, like, like several episodes ago. But even though she's coming back, even though she's evil, you took away Anna from me. All I have now is freaking <laughs> Ishtar and Ash, and I'm hoping those two ain't gonna die. And the only man I have is Gilgamesh, and I don't want him to die. So I'm really scared, really more for Gilgamesh because I don't want Gilgamesh to die. Everybody knows that I'm in love with that fucking man besides Archer, and I don't need, you know, when I cried over Archer, I don't want that with Gilgamesh. I don't want to cry anymore. I get so sick and tired of crying or like getting upset and stuff, but it happens. I mean, that emotional connection. <laughs> It always happens. I don't want him to die. Please. I beg of you, don't kill him. I mean, this is episode 15. We're not even done with this damn show yet. Don't kill him, please. That's all I want. Kill King. I'm fine with that. I mean, he, it don't look like he will survive. But don't kill my husband. Don't kill him. Actually, like, please. <laughs> I beg you, for Christ's sake. Do not kill him. But it was a damn good episode. Wasn't expecting all that shit in this episode, though. But holy shit, that was fucking nice. Like, oh my god. <laughs> but other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards episode 15 of Faker and Order Babylon. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially this Sunday for at the Sunday. Saturday. Oh my god, I'm sorry. <laughs> We're Saturday for episode 16. Bye guys.